Hi, this is Daniel Rizak, and this is Google Apps for the class. Today I'm going to show you how to use a reading strategy called text coding with Google Docs. Text coding is a wonderful strategy that I use with my students to help them improve cognition and comprehension, and I know you'll love it. So let's begin. Text coding is a strategy I pulled from a book called Classroom Strategies for Interactive Learning by Doug Buell. Uh, the point of the strategy is to get students to stop and think about what they're reading. To do this, you give them a handful of codes to mark into the reading as they're doing it. There's R for this reminds me of. Uh, there's other codes like V for visualizations. Um, there's also a handful of other codes, such as uh, E for emotion, Q for wonderment, I for I figured out, and questions for uh, questions that they have, uh, exclamation points for things that uh, are remarkable to them while they read. The traditional way to do this is with a pen and a reading that they can write on, but now with Google Docs, they can do this a whole new interactive way. Instead of a pen, we're going to use the comment feature within Google Docs to do our text coding. For this document, I pasted in a blog post that I found I wanted the kids to read. And I'm going to share that with them. And as they're reading the document, they're pausing, they're putting in their code, and then they're writing a sentence about what they visualize. Or uh, in this case before you, uh, what they don't understand. So they're putting in a question mark. I don't understand this sentence or this word. Uh, they may also put a they may also put a an exclamation point for something that's remarkable to them or something they think is awesome. Now text coding also takes on a whole new life when you can share the document with a group of students. So there you have it. Text coding in Google Docs. If you have any questions about this or any other uh, questions, feel free to comment or follow me on Twitter. I'll be happy to get back to you. Thanks and uh, good luck.